have 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 13. Hello guys, Mr. E143. Okay, so for today's video, we are going to talk about the concept of the Fibonacci sequence. So we already know that the sequence is an ordered list of numbers called terms uh, that may maybe have repeated values. So the arrangement of these terms is set by the definite rule. So ang Fibonacci sequence is meron siyang definite rule. Um, Fibonacci sequence is a special sequence. It is named after the Italian mathematician Leonardo of Pisa, who is better known by his nickname Fibonacci. So, Fibonacci sequence is formed by adding the preceding of two numbers, beginning with 0 and 1. So, mag-start kasi ang Fibonacci num sequence of numbers sa 0. 0 then 1 so, so para makuha natin in order to get the third term or the uh, next number uh, next uh, yes number we're going to add the preceding two numbers yung 0 plus 1 is 1 1 plus 1 is 2 1 plus 2 is 3 2 plus uh, 3 is 5 5 or 3 plus 5 is 8 then uh, 5 plus 8 is 13 then 8 uh, plus 13 is 21 then uh, 21 or 13 plus 21 is 34 then uh, 21 plus 34 is 55 so assuming dyan muna tayo so ganun lang siya then, um, meron ding uh, ginagamit na formula dito para makuha yung, yung, yung number of terms. Um, ginagamit dito is yung f sub n is equal to f sub n minus 2 plus f sub n minus 1. By the way, ito ang mga terms ng Fibonacci sequence. So, mag search ng F sub 0, F sub 1, F sub 2, F sub 3, F sub 4, ganyan. So, so assuming gamitin natin itong formula. So, kunyari, hanapin uh, natin, we're going to find the, the sixth term. The sixth term of the Fibonacci sequence. So, kung hanapin natin yung 6 term of Fibonacci sequence gamit itong formula. We have f sub 6 is equal to f subject natin yung value ng n just 6 minus 2 plus f 6 minus 1 next f 6 minus 2 is 4 then f 6 minus 1 is 5 Okay, so, since nakuha natin ng F sub 4 plus F sub 5, nakuha natin nandoon, uh, alam natin ng value ng F sub 4 is 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, that's 3. Okay, 3 ang value na next. The F sub 5 or 5th term of Fibonacci, we have 1, 2, 3, uh, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, 5. So, Ang F sub 6 ngayon, F sub 6 natin ay 3 plus 5 is 8. So, gamit ang formula. Which is, yun. Yan natin 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Ang 6 term is 8. Okay, so, so what if we have find the 10th term of the Fibonacci sequence? So, uh, uh, napin natin ang 10th term. So, gamit ang, kani ang gamit ang formula. So, F sub 10 is equal to F sub N uh, minus 2 plus F sub N minus 1. So, we have 10 minus 2 plus F 10 minus 1. So, we have F sub 10 is 
8, 8, uh, 10 minus 2 is 8, plus uh, 10 minus 1 is 9, so F sub 9. So F sub uh, 8 natin, ang value niya is 0, uh, F sub 0, F sub 1, F sub 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So alam natin, uh, sorry, we ang um, F sub 8 natin is so, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 21. So, 21 plus, then, ang F sub 9 natin is 34. So, F sub 10. So, ang F sub 10 natin is, So, 21 plus uh, 21 plus 34 is 55. So, ayan ang F sub 10 natin. We just see yun. Okay, so what if uh, evaluate the following sums? So, i-add natin yung Fibonacci uh, number. So, number 1, F sub 2 plus F sub 3 or then F 5 or F sub 5 then plus F sub 7. So, so number 1 muna, we are going to add the um, F sub 2 uh, plus F sub 3. Alam natin ang value ng F sub 2. We have 0, F sub 0, F sub 1, F sub 2. So, ang value ng F sub 1 natin is 1 and then ang value ng F sub 3 natin 0, 1, 2, 3, 2. Plus 2. So, ang um, F sub 2 or F2 plus F3, ang sagot niya is 3. Next, number 2. Subject lang natin ang value. F sub 5. Ang F sub 5 natin is 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, 5 din. Value ng F sub 5. Then, plus F sub 7. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Alam natin ang value ng 7 is 13. So, 5 plus 13 is 18. So, ganun lang siya kadali. Okay, so, pwede rin natin makuha ang exact value ng Fibonacci sequence or Fibonacci numbers. So, meron siyang... Uh, formula para makuha natin talaga yung exact na uh, term ng Fibonacci sequence. So, ang formula nyo is F sub N is equal to uh, F sub N is equal to um, quantity quantity um, 1 plus square root of 5 raised to n then minus quantity um, 1 minus square root of 5 raised sub n over 2 raised n square root of times square root of 5 so, yan ang exact formula para makuha yung uh, yung terms ng Fibonacci sequence. Again, F sub n is equal to quantity 1 plus square root of 5 raised to n minus quantity 1 minus square root of 5 raised to n over 2 raised to n times square root of 5. So, what if kukunin natin ang pang 16 term ng Fibonacci? So, sub sub subject lang natin yung 16 term. 1 plus square root of 5 times 16 or raised to 16 minus then 1 minus square root of 5 then 16 yung value ng natin natin then over 2 raised to 16 square root of 5. So, kapag i-compute natin sa, sa calculator, ang sagot niya is 
907 ang square root of R ang Fibonacci ng 16. So, kapag i-check natin, continue lang natin kung kapag i-check natin kung tama ito, i-continue lang natin yung Fibonacci sequence. 34 plus 55 34 plus 55 is 89. Then, 55 plus 89 is 144. So, 89 plus 144 is 233. Then, 144 plus 233, 300, 377. Next, 233 plus 3, 177, 610. Then, 377 plus 610 is 987. So, tingnan natin kung pang ilang term siya. We have 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So, pang 16 term. 